Hello, everybody. It's April 3rd, 2015. We are in the full moon energy. Three days before, three days after the full moon. It uh, is a very important manifestation time for us, the human beings, the co-creators of this reality, of this existence. So the veil is very thin. Um, you can align with the universal energies. It's very important to to um, to hone this and uh, focus on your thoughts and your words and your vibration and your intentions, which means you need to shift your thoughts to the most positive, purest thoughts, your words to statements that I am powerful, I am creative, I am imaginative, I am caring, I am loving, I am giving, I am outstanding, I am amazing, I am divine, and whatnot. And your vibration, meaning you need to vibrate at a high frequency. You need to be love. You need to be happy. You need to be joyous. You need to be singing and dancing and laughing and crying tears of joy. You need to be at the highest vibration. You need to let go of those low vibratory um, states and whatnot, those of fear, those of negativity, those of limiting beliefs. You need to express gratitude for all that you have. You need to be thankful for all that you have. You need to to do the things that make you happy. You need to go to nature. You need to be with friends and family and be in joy always, especially during these full moons and these new moons when the manifestation is so strong of what you think and speak and how you vibrate and the intention or visualization of the world in which you which in which you wish to live in intention is the most important every day every morning every evening you should be either speaking or thinking your intention your visualization of the world you wish to live in every morning and every evening you should be thinking or speaking this into existence and you should be doing affirmations daily, which is I am statements to the universe that which you are, which you are the entire existence. So do it for yourself, but also for all of us who are fighting for a better earth, a better reality. Um, it's very important. I am peace. I am love. I am happiness. I am joy. I am equality. I am freedom. I am health. I am harmony. I am abundance. Um, we are all one and we need to do the inner work, which this is all the inner work that's going to transform the outer reality. Inner peace creates outer peace. Very important that we dedicate to our inner work. So this video is going on, this audio is going on a little long here, but it's very important you focus on your inner work as, as well as the outer work. Go out into your day, knowing that you created this heaven on earth, and be an angel incarnate. Walk this earth plane and do good. Do for others what you would do for yourself. The golden rule, you know, it's the golden rule. Um, just always be conscious that in each moment you are creating by your thoughts, by your words, by your actions and those beliefs that you hold within you, and take action. Like, you are a god. You are a co-creator. All of us are co-creators. There's 7.3 billion or so of us on this earth. Be conscious that you are a god, and that you're reporting back to base, back to the infinite creator, each and everything that you see, you hear, you smell, you taste, um, that you put your senses upon. You're just reporting back to base so that God or the infinite creator can make changes and transmute the darkness to the light and shift a 3D lower vibratory earth that has been hell for quite a long time into being a 5D higher vibratory light earth, love and light earth that 
is a heaven. There are many heavens. We can vibrate up, 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 and up to higher and higher heavens in our lifetime and in after life times. This body that you are in is not who you are. You are an infinite being. You are infinite spirit. You are infinite energy. So act like it. Know that you cannot die. Know that you are not the body. Vibrate at the highest frequency. Know that you are incarnate on this planet at this time for this exact purpose. To learn, to be, to live, to love. Just be. Just live life to the fullest. Just be happy and enjoy. Just do these things and your world will transform. Not only your world, but all of our worlds. If each and every one of us would dedicate to this process of inner transformation, of inner work, and then go out into our outer communities and create a vehicle, walk through this earth plane, knowing that you are a creator and that God can use you amongst us all, that he's also, he, she, God, the infinite creator can also use all of us, then you will, you will realize this because you will be amongst like-minded people and like-hearted people, and you will be having heavenly days that are miraculous. Your dreams will be coming true. You'll have love always in your life, and abundance will be the way. So do this. Commit to it. Make it your number one. Nothing else is real. All else is illusion. Anything that makes you feel heavy or feel not an infinite being of light. That does not serve you any longer, and you need to let it go. You need to leave that and walk away, and you need to align with those things that make you feel lighter. Light. We are light. Make those choices. Make those decisions. Be bold. Speak your truth. Come out of that shell you've been in all of your life and realize that you are not a dragonfly. You are not a simple, small, little, buzzy dragonfly. You're the effing dragon that has forgotten that you became little. Each and every single one of us has forgotten that we are the dragon and we can blow fire. We can create anything with our thoughts, words, vibration, and intention. We have forgotten that we are God. We are the creators all of us, each and every single one of us, were created by the infinite creator so that we can create. So do not sit in a workplace, a, a square box with a computer and do work for another and give your power to another. Do not vote for another being or let another being be your leader. Do not give your money, your hard-earned money, your energy is what it really is to governments and organizations that are not serving your highest interest. Make these decisions today. Step back and look at your life and realize what is of the light and what is not and cut out all that is not of the light. This is how we're going to, all of us, shift into heaven on earth collectively is by making the right choices and cutting all that does not serve us any longer off and becoming lighter and rising up and floating up to a higher heavenly reality collectively as one. This is how we're doing this and it's happening each and every day. And you just want to join us because you don't want to be left in that earth when all of us angels have ascended to a better reality because it's not going to be fun down there. So make the decision today. Start making the changes today. Take action today. I love you all. God bless you all. Amen. Peace.